You see the spellers on stage at the Scripps National Spelling Bee. Everest. But there's a critical player you can't see, but can hear. Says it Dr. Jean Bailey, the Bee's official pronouncer. I love seeing the kids and um, I like all the words. To the spellers, he's a celebrity. During Bee Week, they lined up to meet the man many saw in the movie, Aquila and the Bee, and who records the words many of them have studied. It's really kind of an honor that they all come here and they think I'm, you know, somebody famous and interesting to meet, and they're, I mean, we're here to honor them. He has a keen understanding of what the spellers are going through. Dr. Bailey won the Bee in 1980 and has some tips for spellers taking the stage. The, the way to spell a word that you don't know, you spell it the way it sounds. Don't make a fancy guess. Don't assume there's a silent cue because there aren't very many of those. You know, just spell it the way it sounds because that's kind of the best guess. His advice for beating the jitters? I, I think a deep breath is one of the best things. It's just, you know, to, to feel free to get up there and go. Because it's amazing how that helps. He believes competing in the National Bee opens doors to spellers to worlds they've never seen before at a critical age. Doors to chemistry, doors to concert instruments, doors to culture of any sort. It's the words, the words that describe our world. Finding satisfaction in spelling. I just love doing this. And in sharing that love with the next generation. I'm Kumasi Aaron reporting.